Damn, he caught up. Who you know who does it better than this? I'm the boy, you done get it. I'm on top of the list, trying to get a good signal like a satellite dish. Every day to me, it's like a solar eclipse. Uh -oh. What's up, y'all? It's your boy Leon, I'm some coolest at African Geek. Welcome to my channel. Back again. This is the other four episodes. You know what I'm saying? I took like a day break. Now I'm back watching the rest of Jupiter's Legacy. I'm mad excited. Where we previously left off, uh, Chloe was causing a muck, being chaos for chaos sake. Well, not for chaos sake. Basically, she has trauma over her powers being a superhero over expectations but she was also jealous that her friend got into her academy she met a, a boy named nick wanted to use her but got sent flying <laughs> um we ended the episode with her overdosing of hutch's it was hutch hutch's drugs he got from the bo he had to get for the boss he ended up making the rod go into his heart hutch is so cool george's son it's being a father son a father son daughter type of show it's the legacy of the mantle each of them have responsibilities anyway i'm totally zoning and thinking about the previous episodes at the same time previous episodes was rightly called out all the devils are here you know what i'm saying everybody was facing demons in that episode anyway let's not waste any more time this is the fifth episode i'm really enjoying the hell out of the show please like and subscribe if you like my reaction you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm planning to react to so many more. Give me recommendations also on what you want me to react to. So I know, you know what I'm saying? Let's dive right in. It's the fifth episode. Does the utopian go to therapy? Things with great. For your gifts. Brandy. It's everybody's Sorry. problem. It's not you. You're not the problem. Everybody else around you is the problem. You see, I called it, he really cares about what people think. That's why he's like this. He's realizing he had dark side to him. Daddy issues made him who he is. So he's good because he's, he thinks his dad was bad. Now I see why this episode is called What's the Use? What? He digged out his dad? Just go to the island already. Hutch actually took her to the hospital. Homeboy was out here looking at her like he was about to save her life. Oh, he still got that cocky attitude. I'd love to see him. Just let me finish the Ever wondered what superheroes do when they free time? Here's your answer. Or a dude who's complaining to his lawyer or therapist, I mean, that his family he keeps arguing with his family. He keeps arguing with his family. You get what I'm saying? Why complain about a problem you're causing? Is what I'm trying to get to. Brandon is building his own moral compass. His whole life it was built on what his father's moral compass is. Now he's trying to figure out what his oh, I is. I already see what his moral compass will be. Nothing can change. Who is that? Okay, Doctor Strange. Oh, they called him to figure out why there's a clone of that dude in prison. Damn, he's tearing him apart. They're removing the armor. Damn. What the hell is that? It's a puzzle. Yo, it's your dad's compass. A clock thingy. It's just gonna lose use his last dollars to fund the trip. The flashback scenes are starting to look brighter. Is it just me? They going on a trip on their favorite rocket ship. Tell me about <laughs> Where's George in the per present day, y'all? Utopian is crying? Oh, it's the daddy issues. Yeah, break down the code. 
practical as it states. Yo, the therapist is preaching right now. Damn. I never really thought about it that way. This code is so they remember him. Damn, it's the exact same thing. Is this some multiverse thing? Is George back? Why would George? I think he's trapped somewhere else. Damn. Yo, if the Utopian catches up. Damn, he caught up. So he knew his son was out there being a criminal? George was your best friend, man. Goddamn. Is she Grace or is she Lois Lane? <laughs> How are they going to convince her? They don't even know where they go. Look at George dropping some logic on her ass. So what's it gonna be? George is the Dan best wingman ever. Sure. Is he grounded? They got him watching the dead body. <laughs> Each other. Who was this dude in the past? Oh, you're looking as fat. Dude is so creepy though. Minute, Why are they mad at him? Oh, he didn't please. know. Goddamn. I guess when you're hurt and you hurt. <laughs> they don't know. When we find what we're looking for, we're gonna be able. They're really out here recruiting people. Here. You know what the door is. Without telling them what they actually recruited them for. So they know he is not responsible, but they still treating him like shit. The fuck. <laughs> daddy issues. Daddy issues. Yo, I need to know what happened between George and the group. Why are they? Why did they show up at some sex club? This club is like this. <laughs> He's gonna need some real convincing right now. He's about to give you superpowers. Just go with him, man. <laughs> what? Now they fuck it. How did it go from the hospital bed to his bed? She thinks it's about her. Ooh, she's turned on because daddy don't scare him. They about to go for a second round. <laughs> the conflict between these two is something else though. Yes, he knows he's gonna get superpowers somehow. No <laughs> oh, I know. Oh, he's just being a great friend. Maybe he's the not best wingman in the game, George. What you know about? Nah. <laughs> nah, you ain't there. You ain't there. Him phrasing it as your narrative is some other. Thing, goddamn. Code is a symbol for being a good boy. Why is this therapist so honest to him? If I'm good, bad things won't happen to me. Look at the therapist preaching. The way the world really is. Yeah. Shades of gray. So the utopian thinks he's in the Truman Show. Thinks the world revolves around him, huh? Criminal genius, Jack Hobbs. No one else understands. Damn, so it's not a therapist, it's a super villain? That's why he was so honest. Damn. At least they gave them nice rooms. So let's talk about it. That was episode 5. Oh, what a good episode. Still have a Utopian battling with his morality and what it means to live in the current world. I mean like this supervillain was breaking it down for him. He lives in a construct of his own trauma created from the moment his dad jumped off the bridge. All daddy issues that we got. George's son also daddy issues with the staff being very comedic. Maybe he told the staff 
earlier on that when somebody comes to me asking me take me to that take me to a strip club yo <laughs> maybe him and his staff can communicate like that chloe and him went from the hospital to his bedroom i don't know how i need more context with that or are we just rolling with it from now on uh george and uh what's his name brainwaves conflict that that's that's big that's big i feel like that was one of the catalysts that made them all turn on george i'm a i'm a george lover what can i say <laughs> he's my favorite character right now i mean the son are killing the game yo chloe needs to redeem herself in my eyes brandon he again punished <laughs> that dude was legit grounded and grounded by making him watch the fucking dead body he killed they got him a sandwich <laughs> and this episode proved that his mother is basically lois lane as far as superman i mean like this show this show is phenomenal let's not waste any more time and dive into the next episode subscribe if you're not subscribed expect daily uploads deuces you know what i'm saying <laughs>